Alright guys, hello everybody, and this is going to be a Hillshot TV tutorial on how to play the new map, Linger Island, for DayZ. <clears throat> First thing I'm going to show you guys to get this set up, and this is to make it really quick and really simple on how to get this done. First thing we're going to do is we're going to take Combined Operations, or we're going to take and make a folder called Combined Operations, okay? This is for Steam users, so not everybody has to worry about this. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your start menu, you'll go to your computer, and then pick whatever drive you have Steam on. Once you do that, um, you go to Program Files, you go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then you should have Arma 2 and Arma 2 Operation Arrowhead. Okay. Once you do that, you're going to make a folder wherever you want to. You could even make it on your desktop. Doesn't matter. Just right click and then you get new folder. And then you could really honestly name it anything you want to. I'll be naming mine Combined Operations. Alright. Anyway. Once that's done, you want to go ahead and take, um, sorry, let me open that back up, my bad. Once you do that, you want to open it up and you want to go ahead and drag Arma 2, the files inside it, the guts here, and put it into that combined operations folder, into this blank folder. So you move them, put them in here, all right? Once that's complete, what you're going to do is you're going to take, um, the next file, which should be, hold on, which would be the Arma 2 Operation Arrowhead, and you're basically going to put both of those into this combined operations folder that you've made. All right, I'm going to go ahead and delete that real quick because I don't need that. All right, once inside there, you'll have all your files and stuff that you need here. All right. And once you have all that installed, we're going to go to the first website that we need to go to, all right? And that's to actually get the map itself, all right? I'll be putting the link in the description, so it's okay. Don't be scared. And what you're going to do is you're going to go to Armorholic and get this. Now, you're going to have to go through a little bit of information, blah, 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 blah. And you're going to see... Download from FTP1, download from FTP2. Just pick one of the two. It doesn't matter which one. Just pick one. All right. Before you leave this page, it is necessary, and I mean necessary, that you go up here while you were doing your scrolling, and it says right here, installation. Here is a hotfix file for dedicated servers running version 2. Remade from scratch. Linger sounds underscore uh, sounds dot pbo dot linger dot b sing you need b sign you need that so you're gonna open that up in a new tab and download it then it'll download the file blah 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 alright so that's done the linger island portion is done that's the actual map and you got it alright now the next part you're gonna go to is daisy linger dot tk once there you'll download the necessary file. Right now, the current one, as of August 1st, is uh, Linger Hotfix 3.1. Now, they do have a little thing where if you can't translate it in English, it actually has a little thing right here. It says, for English-speaking people, it says Linger Island, how to play, yada, yada, yada. All right? So once you get all that good mess, it'll be up here on the screen so you should have two files your linger file which is right here your linger file go ahead and show that to you that's your at linger file all right you're gonna take that you know extract it to the desktop wherever you're gonna extract it now once that's done you want to take that extra file that you downloaded the underscore one I was talking about and you're gonna include it wherever you put this at linger file because you'd open it up you'd go to the add-ons and then you would dump that file in there okay alright that's pretty much the easiest you know the hardest part of this whole process 
Now the next thing you want to do is you want to take the at daisy LNG371. Alright. You want to open that up and you want to take the guts out. Alright. Because I'm going to show you something cool. Alright. The next thing we're going to do is get that combined operations folder that I had. And as you can see, I took those files from the zip and put them in here. You want to create a new folder for the this linger file. For this linger underscore. You want to go ahead and make a new file and name it at Daisy Linger, just like that. All right, and then you're going to take the files from that zip and throw them in here. Now, once that's complete, and you've taken the files and put put it in here for Linger. All right, make sure you've got all that done. Once that's done, we're going to go ahead and we're going to start up Arma. So we're going to start her up. I'm going to show you how you can make sure by positively, absolutely no mistake that it's actually using everything correctly. I'm going to make sure you guys can see it. So give me one second, and we'll go. Th we'll be done here in just one second. Launch, launch, launch. All right. And your armor should launch. One second, guys. Alright, you'll get the Daisy screen. Alright. Let me fix my video options. I'm so sorry about this. Go ahead and bring that brightness and gamma down. Alright. So, back to what I was saying. You want to make sure that you have it say at Daisy. You want to make sure. The biggest thing you want to make sure is Daisy Linger configs blah 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 is there and linger island 1.4 is there and if you also if you notice right here beside the arm operation arrowhead it actually will say linger island right there all right to make sure those are enabled if they're not you're going to hit expansions all right once in here you should see your linger config and your linger island make sure if they're unchecked like this you check them make sure they're enabled you know, you can hover over them, hit enable, hover over them, hit enable. Just make sure they're enabled, all right? Once they're enabled, you're going to hit OK. Then it's going to say, you need to restart the game to apply some changes that you made. You hit OK, all right? Then it'll start back up again, just like this. Alright, see your daisy will start right back up, and it's to make sure that you have the changes done. Excuse me for the long waiting times where we're getting this done. So, <clears throat> it'll be open. Alright. Pretty simple, and you should have the two things I indicated. Over here, you'll see everything. And down here at the bottom, you'll see everything. Now, to get the new map to see the servers that are hosting it, you're going to go to Multiplayer. And then you're going to hit Filter. And you're going to type in the word Linger. L-I-N-G-O-R. Alright? Then you're going to hit OK. And then you should get a big listing of servers. Now, there's not a lot. There's probably maybe 10 or 12 that I've seen so far and you just pick your server and if everything goes right you click it you hit join you should wait for host once you wait for host you hit OK and boom it should load up it might take a few seconds varying on you know your playtime or not your playtime I'm sorry your CPU so there you go now as soon as this launches uh, we'll be done with the tutorial section and I uh, thank you guys for watching Hillshot TV Remember to hit the subscribe button. Remember to come visit me on Twitch. And as always, game safely.